Welcome to Spotlight on Frazee. I am your host, Hank Ludke, and I'm here today at Frazee High School with band leader and music director, Brian Sealander. Hi, Brian. Hello, Hank. So, I understand we've got a major fundraiser coming up for the band. Absolutely, we do. We have uh, a pancake feed. Uh, we are going to, uh, we had one earlier on in the year, in the school year. Uh, we had a wonderful turnout and a, a, a great uh, donations were made to the band. We're going to do that again on January 31st. Uh, it's a Sunday morning. We're going to go 9 to 12 at Bethlehem Lutheran Church. Uh, we've got pancakes. We'll have uh, some sausage, drinks, obviously. And uh, we're looking forward to having everybody out there to, to help support our upcoming trip. So, Well, you know, and of course the trip is, this is a trip to Disney World. This is correct. We go to Disney World. We spend uh, five and a half days down there. Uh, we get to go to uh, all the main Disney parks. We also threw in Universal Studios this year for a, a different uh, spin on things. Um, we got 50 kids and uh, 10 adults going with us. Uh, it's going to be an absolutely fun time. We, we went four years ago and and uh, we had a parents meeting here this week about it and, and the kids are getting pumped up about it. Uh, and I st started reminiscing about the, the last time and, and uh, how much fun it was. Uh, I've, I went down there as a student when I was in marching band in New York Mills, and uh, it's just it's great memories. The kids are never going to forget those kinds of memories, and, and uh, it's, it's, it's going to be fun. So, of course, with that, though, we always have those expenses and that kind of stuff, so uh, that's, that's where the, the pancake feed's coming in, and hopefully uh, help lower the cost of the trip for everybody. So. Well, and, you know, so now they march down there while they're there, too, right? That's correct. Uh, we have we had to go through the audition process, and we had to submit a tape of us marching, uh, and that goes to the Disney uh, Council or committee. And uh, luckily, right away on the first time, they uh, accepted our, our uh, application and our video. We are marching in Magic Kingdom, and uh, they, I just saw the parade route. They had just got an email last week from them, and, and we get to go through on Magic Kingdom, which is uh, the one with Cinderella's Castle. And uh, the, the really cool thing is uh, the parade route is going to take us down right down Main Street, USA. So in the background of all of our pictures as we're marching down, there's going to be Cinderella's Castle in the background. So it's, it's really cool. Well, and I, I think this is a great thing. To me, you know, any time that the kids can get out of their own little milieu, milieu here, their cocoon, and get out in the world big time like this is like you said it's going to be a major factor for the rest of their life yeah absolutely and uh you know a lot of the people we go to, to band contest you know that we we go up to fargo af afterwards and and they say oh yeah this, you know this is the first time out of the state you know and, and they're ninth graders you know it's like wow okay uh well now they're going to be traveling 1700 miles away from home and and uh but it's it's a great experience uh last group i've had just wonderful kids represented our our town community and uh uh, just, just great kids. It was fun, fun trip. So, well, so now you know what you're doing on the morning of the 31st. You're going to be at Bethlehem Lutheran Church eating pancakes and helping the Frazee High School band get ready for their major trip to the Disney World and the Magic Kingdom. What a trip! Yes, absolutely. I uh, look forward to seeing you guys on the 31st, 9 to 12. Stop on in after church and. Uh, we appreciate the support. And Brian, we appreciate you being on the program. And the best to you and your program. I'm glad that the membership is increasing in the band. It's, it shows that you're doing the right thing. And with that, we'll be right back with another segment of Spotlight on Frazee. Welcome back to Spotlight on Frazee. I'm your host, Hank Ludke, and I'm here today with Kitty Kivilak from Community Ed. Hi, Kitty. Hi, Hank. How are you? Tremendous. We're in the midst of winter, and things are great. Things are wonderful. I am letting um, all of our drivers, 55 and older, know that we have a refresher coming up on February 18th in Vergas or April 28th here in Frazee. And we have a full course coming up on April 27th and 28th. So if anybody would like to save 3% on their car, 3%, 10% on their car insurance, yeah. Oh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> yeah, no, I... The refresher is eighteen dollars, and the full course is twenty-five. Well, you know, and that's a good deal. I mean, we used to do it with Trooper Andy, and all that's. I think the last time I did it, they have a new person now because Andy retired. Andy is retired, so we use Denise Lillis, who is certified and out of perm. Well, that's a good program, you know. And for you seniors out there, this is a good way to increase your own personal 
spending money. Plus, safety is just good to have a refresher. You bet. And so what else is going on, Kate? We tried something new this fall. We have a Sunday evening, afternoon um, driver's ed class for high school age students, and that has been successful. We had 22 kids sign up um, if you're in sports or activities or the play or any of that stuff. Sunday evenings are free, and um, it gives them the opportunity to be a kid yet, but yet get their driver's license and be involved in sports. So we're looking at doing that again in the spring. So how much does this program run? It is $300 a child, and that includes 30 hours of classroom and six hours of one-on-one -on -one behind the wheel training. All right, that's great. It is, and you know, people say 300 is a lot, and we understand that you can make payments on it. It's just to liability insurance to insure a driver that has no license yet. Um, you know, there's a lot of expenses involved in having a car and doing that. All right, and what else do we have coming up? March 17th, we have at the Essential Health in Frazee here the blood screening. Um, a lot of people get tested in the fall of the year, and this is their kind of six-month checkup to see how they're doing. Um, if you're at all interested in finding out more and what they test for, you can give us a call at 334-3181. And just hit option three, and it rings right into our offices. And that'll be held where? Right at the Essentia Clinic in Frazee. Oh, great. So, yeah, many people like that. Another exciting thing, because we're on the roll of spring here, we are starting to work on the catalog and getting summer rec activities going, baseball, softball, looking into some busing options. Um, we have swimming lessons. There's just a lot of exciting things happening. Well, and I always get excited looking towards spring. You know, we're halfway through winter just about. And, you know, we're finally getting a little winter. You know, we're starting to see some of that 20 below stuff and snow instead of, you know, being in the 30s, you know, and melting. Well, yeah, and if you're a fisherman or woman, you like to see this kind of weather. Yeah, otherwise you don't have good ice to stand on and you lose your pickup. Correct. They also would like to have a little bit of snow to go snowmobiling, but not always good yet. No, but we'll keep on getting a little here and there. So I appreciate you being on the program, Kitty, and once again, give them your phone number. It is 334-3181, option 3. Or the Frazee District website is www.frazee.k12.mn.us. Give us a call at any time and we can get you signed up. Or if you want to teach a class, we'd love to visit with you. Thanks. And we appreciate having you on the program, Kitty. It's always exciting to have you here with your smiling face, even if you had to have a Diet Coke before you came on. Yes, I'm an addict. <laughs> Diet Coke addict. <laughs> My husband doesn't know this. <laughs> <laughs> well, that, you know what we say. Pet the dog, hug the kids, kiss the wife, wave at the neighbors, and we'll see you next week on Spotlight on Frazee.